The Absolutely True Diary of a Part-Time Indian by Sherman Alexie. And a partridge in a pear tree. When the holidays rolled around, we didn't have any money for presents, so Dad did what he always does when we don't have enough money. He took that little money that we did have and ran away and got drunk. He left on Christmas Eve and came back on January 2nd. With an epic hangover, he just lay on his bed for hours. Hey, Dad, I said. Hey, kid, he said. Sorry about Christmas. It's okay, I said. But it wasn't okay. It was about as far from okay as you can get. If okay was the Earth, when I was standing on Jupiter. I don't know why I said it was okay. For some reason, I was protecting the feelings of the man who had broken my heart yet again. Jeez, I had just won the silver medal in the Children of Alcoholics Olympics. I got you something, he said. What? It's in my boot. I picked up one of his cowboy boots. Nah, the other one, he said. Inside, under the foot pad thing. I picked up the other boot and dug inside. Man, that thing smelled like booze and fear and failure. I found a wrinkled and damp $5 bill. Merry Christmas, he said. Wow. Drunk for a week. My father must have really wanted to spend those last $5. Shoot, you can buy a bottle of the worst whiskey for $5. He could have spent that 5 bucks and stayed drunk for another day or two, but he saved it for me. It was a beautiful and ugly thing. Thanks, Dad, I said. He was asleep. Merry Christmas, I said, and I kissed him on the cheek.